is a friend. The torch represents the light of this athlete's life. He is trying to keep his torch aloft, but the rough, turbulent waters washing against him are obstructing his progress, causing him to stumble. In sports, you quickly learn that you cannot win on your own. You need to depend on your teammates. When facing the adversity of a strong opposing team, the heroic efforts of one individual are never enough to bring victory. Michael Jordan learned this early in his basketball career. It was not until he submitted to the leadership of Phil Jackson, his coach, and consciously made an effort to work within the team game plan with his teammates, Scottie Pippen and Horace Grant, that he won his first championship. So too in life, when the sea gets rough and we are faced with trials and tribulations, we all need to rely on our friends for support. Marcus Tullius Cicero, an orator and statesman of ancient Rome, and considered the greatest Latin prose stylist, once said, The shifts of fortune test the reliability of friends. What a precious gift these friends are who help steady us and share our joys and problems. These are trusted friends who lend their support and strength to lift us up. Friends who have listened to our needs and kept our conversations confidential. Friends like this are necessary if we are to live our lives in the light. Prepared for any challenge. Training and preparation are keys to success in any sport. The proper equipment is also a critical component in any athletic contest. For example, a soccer player would never dream of stepping out onto the field without shin guards in place, or the wrestler onto the mat without headgear for obvious reasons. These are visible forms of protection which everyone can see. However, the trained athlete also takes with him onto the field or mat certain invisible forms of protection that are not so obvious. Each athlete who is prepared to compete has also trained and disciplined his body to withstand the physical challenges and the inevitable contact that he will experience in the course of competition. Just as the body and mind must be trained to excel in any sport, so too must the spirit be strengthened to withstand the challenges of evil. The battles we face in life are not played out in a sports arena, but are actually spiritual battles between good and evil, battles which continually take place in the world around us. Fortunately, there are certain protections available to us here as well. The Bible tells us to put on the whole armor of God, this preparation will directly affect our ability to prevail in any spiritual battle.